just got done doing some trimming, tree trimming, try to trim, make make uh, it easier to mow certain areas, um, blocking the view, and then there's this. Mostly I trim out here on these two trees, these maples, because I don't want to get hit in the head. I don't want the cars damaged. And the, um, I'm not really sure why these trees do this, but I haven't seen this before. But um, that, that has to be some damage from lightning, is my guess. But um, this tree doesn't have that, that I can tell. And yet they both do a similar thing. They're like living and dying at the same time. Now I know trees live and die, but um, this to me is something I'm not familiar with. I, I spent some years climbing trees and doing arborist work, so if I haven't seen it, um, two things. I might have forgotten it. <laughs> or... That's possible, or, or I didn't notice it because of the ADHD thing, but there is something about the trees that that they're, um, and, and the stuff that dies, when I grab a hold of it, I don't have to cut it or anything, it, it just falls apart. That's what makes it dangerous is, these are a couple good sized branches here, over 10 pounds, each one of them, about five of them. And um, they, they hit you or they hit the car, they're going to do some damage. And um, I really can't figure out why it is. Now, it's a wonderful tree for varmints and birds, especially woodpeckers love them. And we got a bunch of them around. But um, for some reason, like look right there. That one I missed. I'm going to have to yank on that one. But... Um, that one right there is, that is like a lot of the others, it's completely dead. And it will come right out of the tree if I grab it and just pull on it. And, uh, and there's another one up there. And that's after I pulled everything I could reach with my, probably could get up there 18, 20 feet. Cause that's a 12 foot pruning pole. And my, my hand up in the air is about seven and a half, eight feet. So I'm 5'10", almost 5'10", so that's what's, that's what's going on. How you doing, Mike? You're on camera. You're on camera. I'm doing a YouTube video on my trees. Have a good one. So, uh, that's my neighbor Mike with the chickens. See if we can zoom in on the chickens back there.